Mike Tyson! Mike Tyson! Howdy, brother! Two old boys, boy! Let's get at it, boy! Mike Tyson, Saudi Arabia! Bring it on! Bring it on! Video to the man, what looks like a Shapton Mallet pig. I'm not gonna refer to your name because your name ain't worth mentioning, mate. But you watch the image of a pig. Let's get it straight. You, my friend, he is no boxing match for you. He was gonna be. But I thought about it. I thought, I'm not gonna make a spectacle of myself in the ring. An old man. What's long past his best? Because I'm sure people want to piece rise and what's that going on? Let me tell you this one: you're having it, bare knuckle, all in, no old bar. Now what I want you to do is no waiting around. I want you to go today. Chapter Mallet Pig. Are you listening to me, Pig? I want you to go today. There's no money for you. No, you might do something of fame for you. Two minutes for plastic. But well, let me tell you something, mate. There's no money in this for you. And I know you haven't got ten pounds. So I'm gonna box you for free. Not box you, fight you for free. I've got fame. I've got money. I've got enough. But what I wanna do is do you some serious damage. Are you hearing me, you pig? So get plenty of steroids and juice down you, mate. Cause I will fight you tomorrow, today, anytime. Hear this. Your address. My address is where I live, where my house is. My address is now, where I live. Can you make a feel where the back? Fight in the back. If that's not good enough for you. Billy Joe Saunders has got a yard in London. I'll meet you in Billy Joe Saunders' yard any day of the week. And when you do come there, mate, be prepared for some serious damage that's I'm going to do to you. It's past it now. And I'm sick of you getting on, you weasel, making videos like a 14 year old boy. You get the image of a shapter mallet pig. What's that too much swill? I'm gonna break your face in, mate. And if you don't show up, I'm at every boxing match in London. Every Warren event, I'm gonna be there, and I'm gonna be looking for you. And you see that? I'm gonna shatter your fucking jaw with it. And I don't even fucking swear. You shot and that ugly bastard mentioning my name. Let's get it on. Today. No waiting. Today. Billy Joe Sons is out in London. That's where I live. I live, Ten acre feet on the back. My I'm making no more videos. I'm a real man. I'm ex rated outside, my friend. That's what I do. No boxing matches, no gloves, because I want to inf inflict some serious damage on you. You'll never do it again, my friend. You push one button too far. So, here to you. Have that. You. Let's see you. Let's see where your balls are now, mate. Let's have it to fucking day. And I can beat you all. And another thing. Here's one for you. Forget you, bum. I'm looking at fighting Mike Tyson. How's that? Mike's making a comeback. I don't value my life for 50 minutes. But let me tell you something. Mike Tyson is the worst in the charity win. He's a proper king of a champion. He's a proper man trying to test him. Some, not some doorman. But I used to practice on as a 14 year old boy. And if I never knocked four or five a night at 15 year old, I was disappointed. But let me tell you something, mate. I'll fight Mike Tyson. He's making a comeback. I know Mike Tyson mentioned the boy's name every five minutes. Here I am. John Fury is hiding from no man. Not even the king of the old men. Mike Tyson. I will fight Mike Tyson. Hear that then? Because I will not be denied. I will die in a fight. I'm as game as an American Yankee dog. I will die with him. I will die before I'll dig in. So let me tell you, mate. Forget two minute rounds. I'll fight you a hundred again. No old bad. I'll rip you to pieces. Chain you to pieces. <laughs> Get plenty of juice down your juice, you're going to need it. End up, Bonk! Bullshit! Look at this shit! I'm the king of the end of the man! I just like Mike Tyson to the death! All your great great sacrifice! I will rock the world! Please, stop me, son! You want to do this? Put the mic down! Put the mic down! I believe you! I believe you! I'm a shit! You don't need this as much as I do. <laughs> we're shaking. Oh, we're terrified. Oh, my God. Enough said on it. Get the money. Half a billion. We'll talk about it. Until then, job. I'm not going to say things to please you because you've had a bad day. If I think you're wrong, I'm going to tell you you're wrong.
you know, and if I'm wrong, I want people to tell me I'm wrong. Not kiss me backside and say, you know, okay, that wall's made of chocolate biscuits when I know it's not. Yeah, have you ever seen the film Brave? Brave, Brave yeah. Mel Gibson? Yeah. Do you remember the old man in the loft? Yeah. The leper? Yeah. I know. Champion, what a lane in Germany from a good source. Hear this, Lynch Lewis. You was frightened of me in my AD, and I just found out from it. He didn't want to fight me, but I tell you now, I fight him now. I'm 50, he's 50, going to a battle royale. I've got back to my lads, but here we can't. Nothing compares to that. Listen, if Anthony Joshua had gone the same route as Tyson Fury, he'd be having tea with a queen every night, you know. Tyson, English champion. All Island champion, British champion twice, Commonwealth champion, European champion, WBC Intercontinental champion, IBF contract 24 and 0, and beat good men, not knockovers like the rest of these men. You know, let me do what it is, I'll, I'll speak straight from the heart. Anthony Josh is a talented man, but in my eyes, he didn't win the Olympic gold medal, he was in Britain, he never got it up. To me, he lost to the Cuban. But that's by and by, that's boxing, I accept all that. But, why give a man more credit than a man who's actually worked hard for something? And Tyson's worked hard for where he is today. He's fought people like the best, Derek Chisora, one of the best fighters in the world today. He still is. He beat him in his prime. He was unbeaten at the time. Who'd ever fight uh, Steve Cunningham? The fellow had been a two-time world champion and in his own backyard and do it. And you'll never see the Anthony Joshua's, you'll never see the Dillian Whites. You'll never see anybody taking chances like that. You know what I'm saying? This kid, that's what, the way he is. That's why he swears, because he's mixed up. Because he hasn't got his just desserts for the F he's put in. This is a true fighting man, you know. But if you take Dillian White out there in that grass field here, look, pull his shirt off and let him have a row out there. Let him, let him have half his ears missing. Let him have the blood pissing out of him. Let him need a hundred stitches after an hour. Let's see how game they are then. He's prepared to do that. Is Anthony Joshua? No. Is Dillian White? No. Derek Chisora? No. Because they've never been in that kind of environment. I know what it's like because I've been there. Oh. Bam. Bam. Oh. Bam. <laughs>